Welcome to Crash Racer. Today we're playing American Fugitive and we're on to part three. Okay, let's go and see what Dwayne, our brother-in-law, has got in store for us today. Ah, he needs a favour. I've got a feeling we're going to be doing quite a few favours for Dwayne. I mean, fair enough, in the, in the last part he did help us uh, find the buzzard vehicle that was outside our father's farmyard when we found him murdered so we've now got that in a lock up okay we need to go and find this crime car and get it crushed by the look of it let's take one of Dwayne's pickups again looks like we can do that no problem Still not really had any run-ins with the police at the moment. I'm, I'm going to hopefully keep it that way as long as possible. So we'll just, there's a police car there, we'll just uh, take it easy. Don't want to draw any attention to ourselves, being as we are on the run at the moment from jail. Is that a lot of police? Oh yeah, they're the roadblocks on the bridges that, uh, that Dwayne was just telling us about. I'm guessing that's just to uh, stop anyone getting out of this area. I don't know if that's for our benefit because we've escaped from jail. Can we overtake these cars before something else comes? Yep. Right, our objective is coming up here on the left. There's the car we want behind that container. Can we just take it, or is there going to be someone around protecting it? Or even in that, even in the car itself, maybe. No one around, as far as I can see. Anyone in the car? Anything around here? More wild mushrooms. We don't need them at the moment. Drive. Okay, we're in. We need to get this car back and get it crushed then. Still no wanted level at the moment. Let's put in front of this tractor. see if anything happens as we come past this roadblock with all the police here. Nope. Nope, we're in the clear. Again, it looks like uh, as we've managed to take it without anyone seeing, we're, uh, we're not wanted, so we can just take our time. How far have we got to go? About 700 metres, not too far. Let's get past this tractor. train line these cars in front are going a bit slow but I don't want to overtake and crash into anything not far to go anyway are we heading this way by the look of it Where do we go now? Somewhere here on the right. Where is it now? Oh, that's it back there. I need to, I think I've missed it. I need to turn around. I've not done a U-turn before, let's see how that goes, see how manoeuvrable these vehicles are. Let's not do it right in front of that police car. Go. Yeah, that's not too bad. Right, where was it? Just in here, somewhere on the left. This will be it by the look of it. 
okay, I guess I need to park it up here somewhere. Okay, in here. Crane controls. That's a lot of controls. Okay, I think I've got it. Let's uh, give this thing a go. Hopefully I've parked it right underneath so I don't have to move it too much. Do we lower? Have we got it? No. Let's try again. It got it? Yeah. Right, where is the crusher then? I guess it's that that thing here just on the left. So we need to drop it in here. Uh let's rotate the magnet. Is that over the top? I don't want to just drop that. I don't think I'm not sure if that's over the top. Let's try lowering it. Just check that it is over. Go on, in you go. That's it. Now let's release. Whoa! Get the magnet out before it closes. The car is getting well and truly crushed. Mission complete. A bit of money for that, and also uh, one of those points that I think we can use to upgrade our skills and perks at some point. I've not done that at all yet. Okay, what next? Visit contacts for missions. I think Dwayne's our only contact at the moment, so let's go and see if he's got anything else for. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay, so he's looked at the the buzzard, the car that that we. Uh, that was at the uh, the scene of our dad's murder. He's not found anything. Oh, that was lucky I didn't step out in front of that police car. Let's see if uh, Dwayne's got anything else for us to do. Oh, the McCoys. I think uh, I think Dwayne's got a bit of a battle going on with the McCoy family from everything he said, and we had a run-in with uh, Jimmy McCoy in part one in prison. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> exactly. Paddy McCoy's car. Okay. Oh, okay. Are we going to accept this? Why not? Destroy the McCoy car. Hmm, I wonder if this challenge is going to be uh, tricky to do without... Um... Oh, we've got some weapons as well now. I wonder if this challenge is going to be tricky to do without getting a wanted level though. We've managed to avoid it so far. Let's have a go. Let's take this tow truck and try and find this, uh, this car that we've got to wreck then. Looks like we're closing in on it. There we go. There's the one. So I guess we just, uh, I guess we just ram it. Destroy the McCoy car. Damage 0% at the moment. Where's it going? into that to tractor all of its own accord. Can we jam it against the bridge? Oh, it's going back the other way now. Come on, turn. I'm not going to get round there. Out the way, tractor. Still no wanted level as yet. Let's catch up quick. Don't want to lose it. There they are. Oh, that's not crashing to that one. Oh, there's the uh, used auto cars in the, the ramp where we found the, the buzzard car there, just on our right.
Oh, that's not nice. Paddy McCoy has run over a pedestrian. And they've got a flashing exclamation mark. I don't know what that means. Whether that means they're now wanted by police or whether they're alarmed or they just missed that pedestrian. Oh, they've just hit that other car. Oh, it's coming down, I guess the train's coming. This might be a good chance to either whack them a few times or even if we can push them in front of the train maybe. Oh, someone on the left hand side has noticed and that car in front is flashing as well. I guess that, So I guess that does just mean alarmed or something. I think maybe we might be better off waiting until we get going again. Because if not we're going to get a wanted level off thing. Oh, where are you going now? Oh, okay. We're going to go round in circles, are we? damage, we're nearly there. Another hit or two. Surely be enough. There we go. Oh, someone's getting out of the car. Oh, it's mission complete. Ah, now if I press accept, does that just transport me somewhere or am I going to get attacked by whoever was getting out of that car? Let's get to... I think I need to be ready to get out the way. Yes, I thought so. I think that was a gun they'd got. Oh, there's a police car. Still not wanted, though. Police car's gone down that way. Hopefully they'll, they'll spot Paddy McCoy, if that's who it was, with his gun. Here's Dwayne. He's happy. We need to hit them again real soon. Oh, he's... Uh, <laughs> he really doesn't like them. Okay, let's... Uh, let's get back, then. Back to Dwayne, see what's happening. See if he's found out any more information on the uh, on the buzzard car yet if he stripped it down and found some clues to who the owner was or who might have killed our father it's coming this way through this I can't work out if this is a car wash or what I'm not sure let's cut over the train line the salvage yard. Right, let's park up and go and see what Dwayne's got to say for himself. <laughs> yeah, good question. Dwayne is not happy with the McCoys at all. I say make peace, I think. Can't see I can't see him listening to that. But let's see what he says if we pick that one. Yeah, Dwayne, let it go. Oh, police, and I'm on the run. I've got to get out. Have we got to run or something? Oh, Hank McCoy. Oh, okay, so one of the McCoys is a policeman. Great. As if uh, we weren't in enough trouble. We're going to have to make a run for it out the back window or something. Oh, okay. <laughs> We're going to have a gunfight, are we? Accept or decline. Do I have a choice? What happens if I decline that? Okay, at least we've got a nice gun to use. Defend yourself. Yep. Some instructions. That would be handy. Let's see how we get on in our first gunfight then. Oh, here they come. Can I run and take cover? I'm not sure. Oh, that works well. Come on, oh, my health is right down. I need to watch out here. Hit points right on the minimum, right at the bottom, but we've managed it. We've uh, we've cleaned out the cops. So mission complete. 
that's probably a, a good place to leave this uh, this episode of American Fugitive. We've had a pretty eventful time, crushing cars, wrecking the McCoys cars, and then a gunfight. Hope you've enjoyed watching the video, and see you soon.